Buhari had come forward to ask for forgiveness from Nigerians. Whoever thought that there has been some form of injustice on him, we are all humans. There is no doubt I hurt some people and I wish they would pardon me. And those that think that uh, I've hurt them so much, please pardon me. As a Nigerian, would you forgive Bugari for all he had done? I want you to watch this video to the end because as the voice of the people, I want to speak on behalf of the people. And if what I will say reflects your opinion, share this video to every Nigerian. This is BVI channel one. You're welcome back again on this platform where we tell you undiluted truth and we look government in their face and tell them as it is with the people. Buhari came forward to say, oh, he must have offended people in his eight years of horrible government. And he's asking for forgiveness. I want you to listen to that very um, speech as we extracted it. Then I'll be right back to speak for the Nigerian people. Yes, same to you. This is the last ill effect you'll be observing as head of state. Many mm. people say you are a highly fulfilled Nigerian leader. Is that true? Yes, um, I thank God. And uh, as I said, I'm looking forward to uh, returning to my town as far away as possible from Abuja so that uh, the incoming government will have... Uh, the time and the space, you know, to uh, take decisions without necessarily having any input from me. I have my eight years and uh, I think uh, I have enough. I can't even wait to go home. If you say that, I'll move to the other <laughs> Um I think the governor a minister, then the president twice. Uh, I think God has given me an incredible opportunity to serve the country. And I uh, thank God for that. So please, whoever thought that there has been some form of injustice on him, we are all humans. There is no doubt I had some people, and I wish they would pardon me. And those that think that uh, I've hurt them so much, please pardon me. Good. You see, this man, Bugari, asking for forgiveness without asking himself what has changed up till now from what he had done before. In fact, what he is bringing forward to Nigerians is worse than what would have passed through in the last eight years under his government. Buhari, you are asking for forgiveness from Nigerians. Why Nigerians have continued to be killed up till this moment? You are leaving Nigeria worse than you met it. Where would we start the forgiveness from? Are we talking about security? More Nigerians are dying under your watch, even as we speak. For the youth in this community. And what I am saying, the complaint that I have this morning, that I want the whole country to listen to, Mr. President to also listen to me, is all about peace and security of this great local government. I am from another, another place called Ikobi. Since the 2nd of January, we have been attacked by headsmen. Nobody from that community can reside in their place. We have been in the local government headquarters. More than how many kilometers in Ikobi, Ogba, Ologba, Ugobi, uh, Ijaha, Olo, uh, Imana, uh, Akpete. All these places that I'm mentioning for you, they are not staying in their places. Which government do that will not pro pro protect its citizens? Those who are dying of kidnapping, terrorist attack, and all manner of violent crimes. 
those who are dying undocumented from hunger because of the hardship you have brought upon Nigerians, battering and shattering the economy. Are we talking about those who have died trying to escape this hell of a country you've made Nigeria to become by trying to follow all manner of inhuman routes to escape Nigeria? So many of them have died in the desert. So many of them are buried beneath the oceans. All thanks to you and your asking for forgiveness. Where would we start from? Even at this point, you said, oh, you have um, set a standard in the electoral process by signing an electoral law that you and your party have continued to flout. You have no respect for rule of law. People who are being discharged by the court, you refuse to obey court orders. Even the electoral law you passed you couldn't, you and your party couldn't adhere to the rules. Where would we forgive you from? Even as you are living, you are not just living a worse Nigeria than you met it. You are handing over to someone whom you are far better than. That is the height of cruelty and insensitivity to the to the Nigerian people's plight, to the agony Nigerian people are passing through under your government. Buari, let it be on record, wherever you are running to, because you said you will even run away from Nigeria. You can't go anywhere. Yes, you've made Nigeria wonderful, eh? You said if they are disturbing you, who is going to disturb you? The Boko Haram, the terrorists, the hardship you have brought upon Nigerians. You want to run away from it? No, you are not going anywhere. No wonder some people will say you are not even a Nigerian. But whatever the case might be, we all will be here. You will be here to serve or to enjoy the fruits of your labor as a president of this country. You're asking for forgiveness. Nigerians, I want to ask you, would you forgive Buhari? Even if we can forgive Buhari for everything that he had done, how can we forgive Buhari for the sham and charade he conducted as an election? The election that brought you in as the president is far better than what you are bringing to Nigerians as a way of transition to a far worse and illegitimate government for that matter. The government of Tinubu you are about to swear in at all costs. Who did not meet with the constitutional provision? <laughs> I tell you, you have laid Nigeria. In fact, you have detonated the time bomb that had been sitting to blow this country apart. And it is to your own credit. That is all I can say. Okay? And Nigerian people, if this... Reflect your opinion. Share it to every Nigerian. Let Nigerians, all Nigerians, respond to this man that have no conscience and have no soul. I'm also the Peters. I speak for the people. The oppressed indigenous Nigerians from the east to the west, from north to south, because we are all victims of your horrible government. I'm signing out. Help me share this video. And I want you to drop it on the comment section. Would you forgive Bugari? for all he had done in office. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.